Your flight has landed and taxied to the terminal. The seatbelt sign has been turned off. Why does it take so long to, in airline lingo, deplane? This can be one of the most frustrating parts of flying, especially after a long flight, and it's even worse for passengers with tight connections. It's not a case of flight attendants simply opening the door so passengers can leave. On the other side of the door, there's a lot that has to happen. The captain powers down the engine and turns off the red blinking anti-collision light, alerting the ground crew that it's safe to approach the aircraft. A gate agent must meet the flight, then enter and move the jet bridge, aligning it with the aircraft door. Once it's in place, there's a signal to the waiting cabin crew that it's safe to open the door. Meanwhile, passengers are standing in the aisles, gathering their belongings and grabbing bags from overhead bins. A few mishaps can add minutes to the process. Difficulty positioning the jet bridge to the aircraft door or not having enough gate agents to promptly meet arriving flights. It's time for patience and a smile as you bid goodbye to the crew at the exit.